uh, another example based on bilinear transformation here in the given example so what they have given so the analog frequencies are given here that is wa is 10 radians wa is 50 pi and wa is 100 pi so the values are given here ws is the sampling frequency how to find their digital frequencies using the bilinear transformation with the sampling period of 0 0.01 second given the analog filter and the digital filter developed here the function for the analog function is also given and the function for digital is also given but the question asked is just to find the digital frequencies so here wa are given as analog frequencies we need to find wd using the digital frequencies so if i find this the problem is solved so let us solve this problem so here as we know that from the equation 11 that we have discussed in the previous video we can calculate the digital frequency wd as follows when w is 10 radians per second with the t is 0 0.01 second we know that the value of wd is 2 by t tan inverse of wa d wa into t by 2 so all the values are given substitute use the calculator find the value of tan inverse we will get it as 9.99 radian per second so you got the digital frequency for the first value similarly you have to do it for the second that is wa is 157 and another one wa is for 314 so like this we can solve the third problem which is very simple if you use the analog and digital frequencies formula that is wa and wd it may be reversed in the exam so they may give the value of wd and they will ask you to find out the values for wa so just you have to remember those formulas for analog and digital and we can get the solution so i hope it is clear for everyone because it is very simple problem based on this problem it is asked for five marks in your external exam also okay they have just given the transfer functions just to confuse so that you can divert from the actual problem simple problem given analog find digital so i hope it is clear for everyone about this value so this is which is given in the extension in this problem this is belongs to the next topic so once we we'll come to the next topic it will be clear okay so hope all the three problems for the bilinear transformation and frequency warping is clear for everyone okay so any doubts you can put a message so thank you